Well, I think when an employer asks that question, why did you choose your major, it's a great opportunity for a student to communicate their enthusiasm for what they're studying here at Fisher. Uh, enthusiasm can really give a candidate the edge in an interview. Uh, when you think about it, everybody prefers to work with enthusiastic people. It just makes them more attractive as a candidate. And if a student can tell a very brief story about something they're excited about with their studies, uh, if they could go back to that moment, I call it the aha moment, where they're working on a project for their major and uh, they're really enjoying it. And they have that moment where like, this is why I'm studying this. And if they can tell a story like that during the interview, it will communicate to the employer why they're excited about it and makes them look very enthusiastic in the interview. When I ask students about why they chose their major. I'm really trying to understand if it was a conscious decision, if it was something that they really did because of a passion for the major, a passion for the classes. They took a accounting course or a finance course and they understood um, or they started to kind of get something that really kind of intrigued them on more than just an intellectual side. They could see themselves doing that from a long, for, for a long period of time versus someone who wants to do a major because of purely financial reasons. I want someone who is really willing to give their all to the job and is really takes the relatively mundane finance and accounting type, type uh, coursework and really brings a passion out of it. So when I ask them that question, I really want to really feel the passion and the, 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 the emotion and the energy they have about their major and about their classes. I think you can tell, you know, it are they really genuinely excited about it? If, if they're showing that they kind of light up a little bit, and believe it or not, that does happen even when people pick accounting, um, I, I am looking for that. I'm looking for a little spark, a little excitement, a little energy when they're talking about it, and enthusiasm for the coursework that they're taking. With this answer, I know a lot of students will sometimes give the, well, I wasn't sure what I wanted to do, so I just chose this randomly, or, they might say, it was only a couple extra classes, so that's why I added it on as a double major. So that's really kind of the wrong way they want to go, wrong direction they want to go. Um, I want to hear a story, really behavioral interviewing, and especially when we're on campus for that first round, it's all about telling the story of who the student is. I want to hear why they chose it. So did they, were they inspired by a certain professor? Did they um, you know, check out various classes or talk to various people in the industry to figure out what they want to do. I want to hear, uh, you know, some sort of connection to the major. Also, maybe what are some of their strengths and how does that fit into the major? How does that fit into what they're going to be learning and, and pursuing? I think when we ask them that question, why did you choose your ma major, or for that matter, ask them anything on their resume, I think we're looking for that that passion behind what they're doing and why they're doing it. Because I think that can carry over into their career after, after school. And I think that's what, really what we're looking for. We're looking for s students that are hunger, that have hunger, that are passionate, that have a drive to want to succeed and a drive to, for results. Well, when I came to Ohio State as a freshman, I knew I wanted to do business, but I didn't know what type of business I wanted to do. I knew business was the right choice because there's so many opportunities in it. But um, So I went to my advisor as a freshman, and I had an amazing advisor, Tata Yamamoto, and we really had a good connection, and I told him you know, what I liked to do and that I always was a fan of math and I always liked to plan. I mean, I'm a big planner. Like Every day I maximize like what I can do and so I told him those traits about myself and he said that I have to do logistics and he just could see me in it. He um, was in that major and was actually the president of the Logistics Association at Ohio State so he really recommended the major to me and I love it to this day. Like I now have had an internship and in, it was an allocation internship at um, Abercrombie & Fitch's headquarters and I learned so much in the internship and it had, we, what I did was a lot of stuff that I'm now learning in my logistics classes as far as like forecasting sales and um, doing different things with um, distributing the, the product to the stores. So this summer really made me realize that I, I really am going to enjoy my career in logistics and now as a junior I'm in my major classes and have, I mean, each quarter they've been my favorite classes of 
like all of the classes I've taken. So I really feel strongly about the major and I've enjoyed it up to now. And this summer I'll be interning as a logistics intern with Nestle. Overall, the candidate does a great job communicating why she chose logistics as her major. First, she tells her story about an upperclassman's advice to explore logistics based on her skills and interests and how this advice was so helpful. Next, she makes a connection between what she enjoys learning in the classroom with her internship experiences and how this has reinforced her decision to make logistics her career. Finally, the candidate makes her enthusiasm and excitement for logistics very clear by telling the interviewer that her logistics courses are her favorite classes. The only improvement the student can make is to close her answer by connecting her passion for logistics with the company and the position for which she's interviewing. For example, she could explain how she's excited by specific responsibility or supply chain strategy.